Welcome to the lesson that will demonstrate how to add your content to your digital poster. Go ahead and go to your Google Drive. And if you put your poster in the location that you were encouraged to do so, which in this case was endangered animals, and I'll go ahead and open up that poster. I'm going to go to my completed notes. I'm going to select the text of one of the animals. I will right click and choose copy or control C for copy. Go to the poster and I will choose edit, paste without formatting. This is really important because you can have some really weird formatting issues if you don't choose paste without formatting. And I'll worry about changing the color of that background later. At this time, I'm just going to copy and paste the information. With all my text added to the poster, I'm going to select one of the text boxes, hold the Shift or Control key to select the other boxes. I will now go to the Paint Bucket tool, and I'm going to choose the light shade of green to match my title. I'm now going to go to the Font option and choose my favorite, which is Georgia, and I'll leave it at 14 because that's a good size. If not, you would come up and change the font all at once. I'm now going to make the text boxes a little more compact because I need to be able to see the animals. You need to get the information in the animals so that we can read it and look at the beautiful pictures. I'm going to move the images and boxes around so that I can get it all to fit nicely. I have moved the images and the content boxes so that it's relatively attractive. I'm not quite done yet. I'm going to go ahead and take the titles of each box and select it. And I'm going to choose Rockwell, which matches my title. I'm going to choose the bold option or Control B. And I'm going to choose 15. Now notice 15 is not an option, so I would type in the number 15 and hit the Enter key. Now because I did that to one, I need to consistently do it to all animals. So I'll choose Rockwell, I will type in 15 and Enter, and Bold. That is the repetition rule in CARP Design. This concludes the session on how to get your content onto your poster. Until next time, you have a wonderful day.